hey guys so this is my quick hands-on review of the juni p15 pro the device actually arrived this evening so i just want to quickly make this review for you guys if you want me to make a full review about this phone then make sure to comment in the comment section below and i'll try to see if i could make a full review or not all right anyways before we head into it make sure to subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell icon for notifications so let's head into it the Juni P15 Pro has a 6.82 inch IPS LCD display. It has a resolution of 720 by 1640, which is HD. It's actually a very nice display. So, for those of you that like watching movies or playing games, this device is a very good device for you. The phone has the latest Android 11 OS, which is actually quite nice. So, you don't have to worry about upgrading or requesting for a system update on this device. The phone has the Helio G35 SoC which is backed up by the PowerVR GE8320 GPU which is a very efficient SoC. It is actually quite good when it comes to gaming but not that good but this device is actually good for let's say daily normal use okay the SoC is good for normal usage. I might actually make a different video uh, showing you guys the efficiency of the SoC but that actually depends. The device has 3GB RAM and 64GB internal storage and I think the device actually has this variant alone. There is no 4GB RAM variant so that's kind of like a huge con. The device has a triple camera setup at the back. We've got a 30 megapixel main camera which is a wide angle camera, a 2 megapixel ultra wide camera and a 0 0.1 megapixel depth camera. I managed to take some few shots uh, with the rear camera and of course the selfie camera is an 8 megapixel selfie camera. I took some shots with the rear camera and the selfie camera so these are the shots. has a massive 6000 mAh battery with a 10 watt charger now this phone is actually quite thin regardless of the fact that it has a very very large battery life for example the redmi 9t also has a 6000 mAh battery and the redmi 9t is very very bulky trust me guys i'm actually shooting this video with the redmi 9t so i cannot actually make a side by side comparison for you guys to see how thin this device is compared to the redmi 9t the device is very very thin and i love the fact that it's actually quite premium it is actually made out of plastic so have that in mind it isn't just any out plastic it is a well polished plastic which is actually quite nice so those are the few details i have about the juni p15 pro and like i said i might actually make a full review later perhaps uh it actually depends though anyways i want you guys to share your thoughts what you think about your device in the comment section below and like this video if you enjoyed subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out